You and I have mutual goals. I mean, working for the feds? There's something else going on here. Someone's got to be running Pikeman. Who? General Hospital latest update, Jason Shields Carly. Dex's jaw-dropping move revealed. In a stunning turn of events, Jason goes to extreme lengths to protect Carly from prison as Dex Heller's allegiance takes a shocking twist. Meanwhile, Dex's drastic decision sends shockwaves through Port Charles, leaving everyone reeling. Plus, as tensions rise, a surprising alliance forms to take down a common enemy. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day, after watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. General Hospital Recap Jason protecting Carly from prison, John demands bait for pikemen. General Hospital Spoilers Recap for Wednesday, April 3rd, reveals that Stella Henry, Vernay Watson, dropped by with a coconut cake for Trina Robinson, Tabiana Ali, and caught Curtis Ashford, Donnell Turner, standing up out of his wheelchair. Stella was elated and wondered why Curtis was keeping his progress under wraps, but Curtis wanted to get stronger before he showed his family. However, Stella made it clear that baby steps were worth celebrating and that secrets were never a good thing, so she thought he should bring everyone else in the loop, especially Portia Robinson, Brooke Kerr. Later, Curtis surprised Portia by taking a few steps as he used the mantle to steady himself. Curtis eventually let Portia help him make it over to her, so they hugged and kissed in a celebratory moment. At the PCPD, Dex Heller, Evan Hofer, introduced himself to Detective Bennett, Kendrick Cross, who refused to shake his hand and put him through a tough interview about why he wanted to be a cop. Dex thought back to being in the military and wanted to feel a sense of purpose again, but Detective Bennett has concerns about Dex's history, especially since he used to work for Sonny Corinthos, Maurice Bernard. If Dex was just doing this as a penance for his time working for Sonny, Detective Bennett warned him not to do it. Dex stood by his desire to have a purpose and do better for himself by serving the people of Port Charles. At Crimson, Nina Corinthos, Cynthia Watrose, had a new assistant named Madison, Virgin Ma, who failed to stop Drew Kane, Cameron Matheson, from entering while Nina was on a work call. That led to Drew and Nina trying to get under each other's skin, but Drew eventually suggested they should concentrate on putting out the fall issue. Nina had a hard time believing that Drew didn't want payback on Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, under the circumstances, but Drew asked what payback had ever got Nina. If Nina could just get out of her own way, Drew offered a prediction and said maybe she could be happy. Nina fired back that she was happy with her career, Sunny, and the only family she'd ever had, but all she had was Crimson now. Drew didn't think Nina was taking accountability for her actions, but Nina argued that Carly wasn't held accountable for insider trading. Nina reported a crime, which was perfectly legal, but she had been exiled by the people she cared about like it was unforgivable. After Nina expressed skepticism over Drew being kinder now, she wondered what he'd do he could push a button, make Jason Morgan, Steve Burton and disappear and have everything go back to how it was before without anyone knowing. Nina moved closer to Drew as the vibe of the conversation turned more intense, but Madison interrupted with information on a new wellness piece. Drew had Nina forward him the info and suggested maybe they'd be able to work together after all since he was interested in it. Once Drew exited, Nina said stranger things had happened. Once Jason showed up in Anna Devane's, Fanola Hughes' office, they were eventually joined by John Jagger Cates, Adam Harrington. When John found out Jason gave Anna updates on their agreement, John ranted about Jason violating the terms. Jason fired back about Jagger not telling him about their history, but John didn't think it mattered since Jason didn't remember anyway. All John cared about was Jason doing his job, and now that Jason's cover was blown, they'd have to shift gears. John insisted Jason would be used as bait to draw pikemen out since they'd be after him now. Jason objected since that could people he cares about in danger, but John felt he'd just have to be careful. Unless Jason wanted Carly to go prison over the RICO violations and criminal conspiracy charges, he'd do what he was told. Jason said he'd do whatever John wanted as long as Carly stayed protected, so Anna thought everything made sense now. John didn't want Anna involved in the FBI's investigation due to her history with the WSB, which was intertwined with Pikeman. 
Anna tried to convince John that they were both playing on the same pikemen takedown team. After John reiterated that Jason would need to be used as bait, he headed out. Anna brought up the fact that Jason was protecting Carly, but he warned that she could never know and stomped off. In Carly's kitchen, she helped Jocelyn Jack's Eden McCoy and Donna Corinthos Scarlet Spears with a lasagna before Michael Corinthos Chad Duell arrived with Wiley Corinthos Byron Weaver. In a moment alone, Michael came clean to Carly about hiding Jason at the boathouse and shared how Willow Corinthos, Caitlin McMullen, really stepped up. Carly also gave Michael news on Jason's FBI informant situation and Sonny's livid reaction. Once Willow popped up later, she got Carly's gratitude for helping with Jason while he was a fugitive. Willow confessed that she knew about Carly and Drew's breakup, so she hoped Drew could put his life back together and find something that mattered to him. Afterward, Carly made sure Jocelyn was holding up okay, following her own split from Dex and gave her some support. Jocelyn, Carly, Michael, Willow, Wiley and Donna eventually gathered for their lasagna feast since they had a lot to celebrate as a family. General Hospital spoilers say more complications are brewing for Jason, so stay tuned to see how Carly will get pulled into all the General Hospital drama. Today's next update, Dex makes shocking move. General Hospital spoilers promise Dex Heller is about to throw everyone in Port Charles for a loop with his next move. And nothing will ever be the same on the ABC soap opera. General Hospital spoilers, Dex Heller turns on Sunny. Until recently, on General Hospital, Dex Heller, Evan Hofer, was working for Sonny Corinthos, Maurice Bernard. Of course, he only joined the organization because Michael Corinthos, Chad Duell, hired him to take Sonny down from the inside. But, eventually, Dex grew to like and respect Sonny. Then, Michael changed his mind, and they both agreed to protect the mobster. However, it all blew up in their faces when Sonny found out and he almost killed Dex. Then, things took a turn on General Hospital. His girlfriend, Jocelyn Jack's Eden McCoy, found out he was prepared to kill Cyrus Renault, Jeff Kober, for Sonny. That was too much for her, so she broke up with him. After that, he confessed to police commissioner Anna Devane, Fanola Hughes, that was going to end Cyrus. And he was ready to suffer the consequences. However, Anna told Dex his confession was pointless because it wasn't enough to convict Sonny. So, she pretended their conversation never happened on General Hospital. He told her to keep him in mind if she ever needs help taking Sonny down. Later, she made him an offer. Instead of charging him, she wants him to join the PCPD. That way, she can use his knowledge of Sonny's business to finally stop the kingpin and it looks like he's going to take her up on her offer soon. General Hospital Spoilers, Dex Stuns Port Charles Originally, Dex thought if he left town, it would be the best thing for everyone. He wanted to protect Joss and her family and also keep himself alive on General Hospital. But now that Anna wants him on the police force, he has reason to stay. This week, Dex has an interview regarding the PCPD. Later, Jocelyn's in shock. So, it appears that news begins to spread about him becoming a cop. Perhaps, Joss may give him another chance now that he's on the right side of the law. Everyone will be stunned when he goes from mob enforcer to police officer. But Sonny will surely flip the most on General Hospital. The mob boss already sees Jason Morgan, Steve Burton, as a traitor for being an informant for the FBI. Once he learns Dex is part of law enforcement, he may lose it. He's being targeted from all sides now. Plus, he's headed for a breakdown because Valentine Cassidine, James Patrick Stewart, is messing with his bipolar meds. And soon, there's a chance Dex could be working close to Valentine, even if he doesn't know it. PCPD newbie becomes Pikeman Mole on General Hospital? Coming up, on General Hospital, Anna may plant Dex in the Pikeman organization to dismantle them from within. Soon, Jason gives her info. Then, she grills Jack Brennan, Charles Measure, about Pikeman. Later, John Jagger Cates, Adam Harrington, comes up with a new way to destroy Pikeman. So, everyone is working against Pikeman and Dex could very well be the key to their downfall. But his new career move may flip Port Chuck upside down. General Hospital is hotter than ever.
Keep watching to see how everyone reacts to Dex Heller joining the PCPD and if he'll live much longer on the ABC daytime drama. It's sure to be dramatic and intense. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.